Hello, I'm Pastor Keith Free, the administrator of Home Missions. A church is a communion and a community, and people want community. A place where people know you, where everyone cares about your well-being. For a new mission congregation, knowing how to create this kind of community is vital as the pastor and members look to tell more people about Jesus Christ. Castle Rock, Colorado is growing. It's been repeatedly listed as one of the best places in America to live. And that means new families are arriving here almost every day. That sets up an ideal situation for a mission church as young families in transition look to put down roots. We were new to the neighborhood, new to the area. We just walked in some Sunday morning and were just greeted with uh, open arms, um, down to earth people, and just a very welcoming community feel. Yeah, you don't have a meter checker, do you, for that? Like for the Our Wells mission here is Eternal Rock Lutheran Church, led by Pastor Jared Oldenburg. Like most young missions, this group does not yet have a church building. Instead, they worship in a rented space each week. But that hasn't slowed the work. So I thought, you know, with my husband, I said, let's just try it. Let's see what this all entails. And we came and we love it and we love serving and we just, we love everything about this church. Building a mission congregation is often a long road. Reverend Oldenburg arrived here seven years ago with three resources, the Word of God, his family, and the support of Wells. In the early days, it's especially helpful for a mission pastor to know he has the encouragement of Wells members everywhere as we all walk together. There's a lot of times where you feel completely alone. For me personally, there's a lot of encouragement to know that there is a, there's a group of people that is not just rooting for you, there's a group of people that are praying for you and they want your mission to do well. Each home mission begins by working to understand the unique features and needs of its community, and then finding the best opportunities to share the gospel. In Castle Rock, one thing young families are looking for is personal connections, opportunities for authentic relationships. I think more and more when you talk about themes of authenticity and community, People want a place where they can feel like these are my friends. They can go there and say, I know this person, I know that person. And, and the way that you do that is through shared experience. One way this congregation built a shared experience was here at the local movie theater as they screened the new movie, Martin Luther, A Return to Grace. The festive atmosphere brought people together for fellowship, fun, and a deeper understanding of the Lutheran church. So thankful that all of you are here and I'm excited for a great night. So we're gonna get started up in just a minute or two. I cannot and I will not retract anything. The film, oh man, it was just so well done to know that Christians don't rely on how good they are. That's probably the biggest takeaway for me. God has forgiven it all. It was a very good movie to, I'm sure for people that already know about Martin Luther and for people that don't know anything like me. It's just a great opportunity to see other families, see other kids, um, and just kind of have that social interaction with them outside of church. Screening the new Luther movie is just one of dozens of ways this mission church is building community and strengthening relationships. There are seminars on marriage and parenting. Yes, Thomas, it's called a miracle. Kids camps on art and music, service projects, and of course, Bible classes. All those efforts are in support of the congregation's primary goal, preaching the word and administering the sacraments to as many people as possible. How does our home missions decide where to plant new missions in order to tell more people about Jesus? Often that process starts with people like you. Wells members see opportunities and pass information to their district mission board. The boards then follow up on those ideas. By God's grace, since 2013, more than 30 new home missions have started where connections with the Lord becomes the most important community. To learn more about home missions, visit wells.net.